Hello everyone and welcome back to Royal Park Fine Wine, another episode of What's Hot Now with your host, Joe Susu. So today we're picking on uh, two different wines. Uh, the first wine is Guru Red Blend. Uh, in the past, a few weeks ago, we've done a wine that is somewhat similar to this wine and it was a huge hit for us, which is Guru Gold. Not the same company. Uh, this is a uh, somewhat of a similar wine. It has a great rating of uh, 91 points. Uh, this is a 2017 Guru Red, uh, Red Blend. It is a 70% Monistral, 20% uh, Syrah, and 10% Cabernet. It is from Jamela of Spain. <sighs> Bold nose. I'm getting some tar in a good way. Uh, deep berries. Dense purple fruit and also dense purple color. Wow, what a body on it. Uh, spice berries, little rustic, edgy, uh, takes me into, f you know, food friendly wine. Live acidity, little smoke, uh, delivers lots of complexity. Complexity and bodies definitely there. Yet at ten ninety nine a bottle, this is a ninety one pointer. So this is this should be another great great buy for us. Uh, you guys will definitely enjoy this. This is a um, a another great buy. Uh, the second wine we're going to be going to Australia. So this is a Shiraz, shot fire Shiraz. Some of you are familiar with this. It's been on the market for a while. Uh, it is a Barossa product. Uh, we've sold this product for a few years now. It always gets some really, really good uh, rating. It is a 2018 Thorn Clark uh, Shot Fire Shiraz. Wow, you should see the color on this. You'll not, you're not going to see through this wine. This is such a dark, intense, very typical of Shiraz. It is 100% Shiraz. The nose on it had some sweet fruit and spice. It also, a slight tobacco. Um, beautiful nose. It is a sweet fruit nose on it. So I'm getting currants, uh, cherries. I'm getting a little licorice. I'm getting some, that sweet barbecue sauce when you smell it. If you make a fresh barbecue sauce, you get that aromas of that spice in it. That nice peppery um, barbecue sauce. Uh, it's, it's definitely rich and dense. I'm getting cocoa powder on it. It is very energetic. It has medium tannins, but it is all over the place. Well-made wine. So if, if you're into that nicer, fuller body wines, this is definitely one to try. It has a beautiful velvety finish. I would serve it with some uh, grilled meats. Uh, your choice of meats, anything on, on the barbie would be absolutely delicious. Uh, and strong cheeses. I wouldn't shy away from serving this with some dark chocolate. It takes me right into that. Again, this is a $21.99 bottle of wine that um, I would put this against a whole lot of $30, $40 bottles. It's got some great features and very, very enjoyable. Uh, that's it for today. Thank you so much. Cheers and be safe.